What's up? What's up everyone? Just hanging out. That's what I got going on. Yo, what up, team LMDU? What is going on? I'm just cleaning off my camera. What is up? How you doing? I'm oh, just hanging out at home right now. I think this is going to be my last night staying here, so I'm kind of chilling, you know? I think I'm going to. I've moved majority of my stuff over to the new place. So I think I'm going to stay there tomorrow night. Because it's, it's much quieter neighborhood. Much quieter neighborhood than here. Yeah. Yeah. I did not find my key. Mm -hmm. Where are you up here? I'm just hanging out alone, you know, just hanging out, having a Laura bar. Mm -hmm. That's what I got going on, which I love too. few weeks ago, I remember. Hmm, I don't know, I don't remember. Do you know any good microphone brands? Bro, it was hot in SF today, I got some burned. Yeah, today was like slick hot. You really didn't like spun? Mm, I didn't like it as much as other places I've been to. Oh yeah, there was 26 countries, I think, in one year. You should smoke out your room. <laughs> For the last night. Mm, no, I don't think I want to. Some new people just moved in next door. And it's pretty nice. I'm moving out, I'm moving in. I'm the guy from NY. I'm from NY, the guy with the boosted we met at the boosted meetup. I still don't remember him because I met so many people with them boosting me up. Mm -hmm. Ever been on Cafe Pacific or worse? I've never been on Cafe Pacific or worse, not sure. Um, where will you be off to next? That's a really good question. So what I'm gonna what I what I think I'm gonna try to do is I'm gonna cross my fingers that that the prices fall in, in SF just a little bit. And if they do, I cross my fingers that I stay here one more year. And then after that year, I'm just done. Like, just peace out, you know? So that's kind of my plan. Where will I take off at first? It really depends on what places are open, you know? And what, what restrictions. Yeah, you're right. Give the new peeps a break. Yo, Chinatown um, open. I haven't been there, there in a while. Yeah, Chinatown's open, for sure.
Yeah, yeah. So what y'all up to tonight? I'm curious. You guys back just at home? Did you just get back from the club? Did you just get back from the underground club? Like, no, I did not get a new key. Yet. So what I did was um, there's this thing called a virtual key, where they send you this code on the phone, and you can enter the building with the code on the phone. <laughs> like you straight hold up the phone in front of the camera and it straight up lets you into the building and it also lets you press the floor on the elevator. Um, but then I also, I have a key to the actual door. Um, it's, an, it's a different key I have to the door. But ideally, um, one key would work for all the doors. Vero Apartments. I don't know, there's so many apartments in this, so. Like if they, if those are in the mission, I'm probably not gonna really check it out, cause I'm only gonna check out places that that I wanna study, you know. Look at this. Oh, I've dropped off here plenty of times. I've dropped off here plenty of times, but check this out. My thing about that place is, um, is I really like summer. That's, that's my, that's my whole day. I really like summer, yo. And if I'm going to pay those prices, I'd rather be in summer or I'd rather be in, in like a nicer neighborhood. You know what I mean? Um, I'm not trying to knock, I'm not knocking the mission at all, but I just feel like I don't know, just, I, I think I would be, get more bang for my buck down in Soma or in a different neighborhood for, for that price. You have cool eyes. Mm, thanks. which building do you look at right now? Mm. I don't think I'm gonna say, but I will make a, I will like release a video probably in a couple weeks showing my place and also revealing how much I'll pay on it. This place, you know what, guys? I'm gonna, I'm gonna just be honest. This place is so incredibly noisy. Like, I don't have to move out until the 30th. But this morning, dude, basically, like every morning, there, there, there's someone, there's someone upstairs, like, that they're like dragging stuff around. Like it sounds like they're dragging furniture, but it doesn't make sense because they're literally dragging this for like an hour, okay? And it's just like, it's early in the morning, it is late in the afternoon, and like th this afternoon they're banging for like an hour, right? Just straight banging, like just nonstop, like banging, 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 right? And I, like, left and went to Target and, like, went somewhere else and came back. It was, like, 30 minutes later, right? They are still banging. <clears throat> and I was just like, yo, what the fuck? Like, so I was just like, dude, I think I'm just gonna go just stay one more night and then just peace out, you know? Because I have a hard time sleeping because the Wi-Fi is, like, underneath the bed, you know? you can't unplug it 
And they say that like, if you sleep really, really close to the Wi-Fi, it can like mess up your sleep patterns. And let me tell you something. I had a hard time going to sleep. Mm-mm. I'm not really going to sleep, but like I'll wake up in the middle of the night, you know, can't go back to sleep, like, yeah, let's go. Mm-hmm. from the hood. Why you like Soma more than the mission? I like Soma more because it's more centrally located. Depending on what part of Soma, actually. Because I actually went and looked at a place. It's somewhere on Falsehood. Like, somewhere on Folsom, right? You know, in between like 9th and 6th, like somewhere near, near there. And I, mean, I, I, I kind of didn't like the area so much. You know, but like Mission Soma, I really like the Mission Soma area a lot. Hey, Jermaine, are you still coming to Sri Lanka in the future? But still, the airport here is not open. Yes, I do want to come to Sri Lanka in the future. The Hadjiman, are you in your new pad? No, I'm not in my new pad right now. I moved a bunch of stuff there, but I haven't, um, I haven't, um, I haven't spent the night there. I think I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to stay tomorrow night. Yeah, this is my last night here. I'm going to miss this place because this place is pretty chill. But I like the new place because I like the room, like, it's, like, really large, and it's not, like, full of furniture. Because, like, this room is, like, it has a bunch of furniture in it because it's furnished. I mean, it, 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 I like the location, too. Travel to China. If not, don't come. No, I'm not gonna go. Um, I have no plans on coming to China. Traveling to China. I found someone today that's gonna redo my hair. Actually, they're really gonna, they're just gonna redo it from the roots. Did you ever check out Seven Apartments in Selma? A seven L. Um, I don't think so. Well, you know, I kind of stopped checking out apartments in summer because I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna keep it with you guys. They're kind of all the same. <laughs> like they're kind of all the same. They 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 all, they all have so many things in common that like whenever I show you like on a video, it's like. I feel it's not really, I mean, after I make three videos showing different places, it's kind of hard to show different places because the insides look so similar. And a lot of the places like the amenities are closed so you can't even see them. So I did this place on this, like I did like that. I went and looked at a bunch of different places, but some of them, there, there, was, there was just no way I could film. You know, some of them were just like, I can just tell like the person that's showing it was very, very uptight, you know, and like very like, you know, like very serious about renting it, you know what I mean? So like, I wouldn't want to pull out a camera, you know? But then you go to some places like, like when I went to 50 Jones, like, the guy was like super chill, you know, he was just like, oh yeah, I mean, yeah, come on, yeah, man. He was just like super nice, you know. But like not every place is like that. <laughs> like some places are just like, you know, you can tell they work on commission, you know what I mean? I hope people are still not 
racist during this pandemic. People are always racist. Um, would you mind, could you send me some names of coding schools that you know of in San Francisco? Um, check out Codify. Check out, um, gosh, there's one that's really popular. I always see people wearing their freaking jerseys out in there. Ha Hacker Reactor. That's a very popular one. It can be a little controversial, you know. Do you experience a lot of racism in San Francisco? Um, that's, a very, that's kind of a that's kind of a tricky question to answer because. That's a tricky question to answer because I'm going to answer it like this, okay? So, my perspective of someone being racist is probably going to be a little bit different than your, I don't know, it's probably going to be a little bit different, right? So, I can sort of understand when someone is, is ignorant towards culture. You know what I mean? And I can also understand the difference between when someone is racist, okay? I believe here in San Francisco, there are racist people, of course. But I also think there's just a lot of people that are just very ignorant against culture. So they're just like afraid of like people of other cultures or different cultures than they've been around. So. Maybe they are racist, but, but it's, or maybe they're not. Maybe they're just unfamiliar with people that are unlike them, and they are so unfamiliar with people like them. When they get around someone that is not like them, they just don't know how to react, you know? That's the perspective that I see. You know, I see that a lot here. Um, and, and you're right, um, there are many levels of racism. Yeah. Mm. Do you think Prop 22 will pass? I sure hope not. I sure hope it is dead. I sure hope it is completely dead. Yo, yo, dreads. Oh, thanks. Thanks. Dude, they're like a lot of work. Like, I'm fighting a late game right now, big time. Alright, I'm fighting the late game. You know, when you get like a lot of late game, right? Yeah. Doesn't Prop 22 make Uber's viable again? I really haven't followed it, actually. Um, looks like you got in the house. Looks like you got in the house. What do you mean, looks like I got in the house? Are you, like, one of my new roommates or something? So how is the gig economy now in Cali? Has smelling it stupid? Um... The gay economy still exists, you know, it's still a big city, you know, there's still lots of people that don't go out and shop, they just order things offline. A lot of people have left the city, but not everyone has left the city, I mean, there's still, there, there's still people. Are you still blazing during this pandemic? What do you mean, am I still blazing during this pandemic? Hey, Jermaine, where is the meetup spot for the night? So I don't, I don't know the, um, I don't, so, the roller skate meetup, that's Friday night, and that's at 9 o'clock in front of the ferry building. So, you know, in front of the ferry building at Market and Embarcadero, in, in the middle of the street, there's like this this meteor in the middle of the street, right directly in front of the ferry building. 
you'll see a bunch of people like meet up there like right before the mountain. It'll be like mad people there, like maybe like 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80. It depends on like the virus has been playing with it. Some weeks I've seen like, okay, put it like this, like about a month ago, it was maybe like 75 people out. Last night, Maybe it was like 30 people out, you know? Like the virus, like, it makes people come out less. But then also it was smoky last night too. Mm, I looked up how to make money off Snapchat and your stream popped up. I saw your address. So I thought I would join. Oh, that's what's up. You should freaking join, subscribe, watch a bunch of videos. So what food services are you going to work now since career is going to close? Um, you know, I'm working for a couple of different apps, you know? Um, I'm just going to see how things go. Work, workhorse, what are your thoughts? You know, I think workhorse is... I don't think it's a it's a bad stock, but it's one I'm not really subscribing to. I'm gonna tell y'all right now what I what I'm doing. I'm looking at Beyond Meat. Yeah, I've been jumping on Beyond Meat, and I've also been buying some of the art phones. I want to get like about a hundred about a hundred shares of a, a lot of those art you know those art ETFs. I want to start you know clicking those. You know, and start um, collecting more Beyond Meat. Beyond Meat's kind of expensive. Like, I want to have at least 100 shares of Beyond Meat, you know? But, um, you know, at that price, I think it's about $130 right now, you know? So, if you want 100 shares, it's going to be like 13, 13 grand. So, it's, it's kind of pricey, you know? Kind of got to take it a little slow on that one. You're skipping my comment. No, a bunch of these comments. Wait, you're sure to say my dude. Another day, another FN show. Once the world's opened up and you're going to come travel to Africa or Asia again, I'm going to both. Um, what are your thoughts about Mission Bay? Mission Bay is cool. Speaking of groceries, it is expensive being vegan right now. It's actually much cheaper being vegan than it is um, being a non-vegan. I mean, you know how much meat costs in the store? I mean, do you know how much meat costs? Like, that's what we don't eat. <laughs> that's the most expensive part. Um, do you think Liv is making a mistake not having his own food delivery app? You know, <laughs> that's a really good question. That's a really good question. Because Lyft, the only thing they have is the bikes, no, the scooters, right? That's the only diversification they got. And they're not even in a lot of countries. How do you mean? How much profit do you... So I'm not gonna exactly say all of my shares and all that. I know a lot of YouTubers do, but I'm just not. I mean, I'll show my Robinhood account, but I'm not gonna talk about like everything. You buying Tesla? So, that's a really good question. That's a really good question. Am I buying Tesla? Because it's so high right now. So after the split, maybe I'll buy Tesla. But I'm thinking, this is what I'm thinking. Like, <laughs> like I almost don't want to say this, but I'm just going to go ahead and say this because I could be right. <sighs> what if we saw Tesla go to 2500 and then it's split you know uh, what if we saw Tesla go to 2500 and then split 
and then that would be five hundred dollars a share after this split. And you already know it. At five hundred dollars a share. It's just only gonna. I think it's only gonna keep going up because when people see, especially okay, yo, think about this, y'all. Robinhood investors have shot Tesla up, but when Robinhood investors Tesla is five hundred dollars a share. It's not gonna be five hundred dollars a share for long <laughs> because they're just gonna drive the damn price right back up. That's exactly what's gonna happen. That's what I think is gonna happen. When they have that price cheap, I think it's just gonna be just a matter of time before it goes from four hundred or five hundred to a thousand again. Good night. What are your thoughts on the Apple split? Monday is the last day to purchase before the split. I mean, I think it's okay. You know? Most travel vloggers are middle aged, white, or young. And, like, how do you feel about. I don't know. I feel different, like, breaking the mold. What are tips for being a vegan? Let's see. You gotta lose a lot of tips. I want to buy your shirt. <laughs> Unwash my dude. Oh, you just wanna like buy it like off me? <laughs> they have bikes and scooters. Did you finally get a key? So I got like, like someone got a key. Someone got a key. Uh, I have access now. Ooh, hello, Sarah White. Um, where can I buy that shirt? I will pay top dollar. So this one, I actually don't sell this on my site. The reason why I don't sell this on, on my site because I um th th I didn't really like the setup. I have another style, it's so got a different front because these 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 corners are really sharp. Um, I think in a couple of days I'm gonna make a video of me making shirts, so. If y'all want to see that, like, it'll come out in a couple of days. What up, Alex? What's going on? Jermaine, mask can be so... Oh, okay. We're going to be neighbors soon. Get ready. What do you mean we're going to be neighbors soon? What's up, Alex? What's going on? I need that show. You don't watch it, sell it to me. You want to just buy it, like, just without watching it? I mean, I'll sell it if you want. <laughs> I'm moving to either Summer or Mission Bay. Oh, really? See, Mission Bay is cool, but Mission Bay is down there, y'all. Mission Bay is deep down though. I think the market is so freaking ideal, yo. The market is freaking so ideal because it's just it's just the middle of the city. But then also the market's gonna be loud. The market's gonna have a lot of a lot of street activity. Negative street activity, you know what I mean? And when I mean negative street activity it can be from you know, people stealing shit from protests going on all the time to, um, it, they, you know, homeless people to, you know, panhandling. Like, it just, all sorts of stuff happen. Like, so, it's just a hot, hot street. Drinking soda is worse than eating meat. Well, that's okay. 
Who said I was, um, I never went vegan to be healthy. What do you think of the dog pets generally? The dog, dog pets generally is a quiet neighborhood, yo. Um, how do you like the new place? No music from the neighbors? What do you mean, no music from the neighbors? I don't get that one. Would you man, don't you need a truck to move to your new pet? You guys would not believe that. I freaking already basically moved everything. Already. I, I took a freaking taxi, right? And I bought a freaking dolly from the um, hardware store. And I... Um... Put the boxes in the dolly, you know what I mean? And freaking request a cab and then, you know, got dropped off there. And then... I took some more stuff later. Other spot used to have loud music and noise all the time. Oh, you mean this spot? Yeah, I'm still with the old spot right now. Will you buy a dog? I do not want a dog. And I do not want a partner with a dog. <laughs> That's just my thing. Nothing against dogs. But the type of person I am... It's just the dog's not gonna work, you know? Like, I don't wanna get a dog and then I wanna travel and I gotta, I'm gonna miss the dog. I gotta, I just wanna take care of the dog. And, and then also, I really don't wanna partner with a dog. Like, I don't wanna partner with a dog because, like, straight up, like, I have, I have straight up, like, talked to, like, women, right? And I'm sitting down talking to them. Right? And we're having a conversation. And as we're having a conversation, they stop and they just pay all their attention to their dog, you know? Like, I, I don't even want to, I don't even want to be friends with someone like that, you know? Like, I'm, I'm, I'm just going to keep it real because if you are paying that much attention to your dog, you should probably pay more attention to your dog. And anything I got to say is probably not that important, you know? I don't know. That, that's just me. It, I get it. Not every dog owner is like that. Like, I totally understand. Not every dog owner is like that. But I have experienced that, and it's kind of like, okay, I'm just saying, you might kill an animal. <laughs> People with pets. <laughs> Jay is jealous of the dog. Probably. I don't know. He needs a shirt. He needs a shirt. Another day of the adventure. It's like that safety green color, so like you can see it from like far away. I forgot what size this is. I think it's like small or something. Medium. I am too much. I am too much. I am not crochet hook. This chair is so squeaky. But I'm not tripping. You should sell your pants on mom, Jay. You like my pants? Which ones? The ones I got on now? Have you even seen my pants I got on right now? I know if they have another adventure, don't come to Vegas, it's boring. I don't mean boring with that one. <laughs> Jermaine doesn't carry any boring clothes. No, I don't have any suits and no shit like that. How are the roommates? Um. They, they're, they're different, they're cool, um, they're students, they're like, um, 30s, so kind of like the same age group, I am in San Francisco, 
They are building a boring tunnel here. Yeah, I heard about that. Like, I really want to find my crochet hook because... I'm like staring at my hair and I want to pick at it. So. Sorry, I'm so ADD, y'all, but like, you know, this is your boy, Jermaine. I think here's a crochet hook. It's a triple crochet hook. Subscribers, ADD stands another day. Another day? No. Is your hand still injured from falling? It it feels a lot better. It's not like one hundred percent, but like it's pretty close. What's the biggest turd you seen in the teal or foot home? No. The teal is not that bad, man. It can be. It can be bad, but it's not the worst thing in the world. People are exaggerating. Man, but don't look at me wrong. You can see some you can see some messed up stuff going on. Definitely didn't say you wouldn't. From the Netherlands. Are you looking to buy a new e-bike? I'm not looking to buy a new e-bike. You know, I'm I'm playing. I'm I'm thinking of um a exit plan for the city. That's what I'm thinking of. And I think I got a really good exit plan for the city. I think I got a really good exit plan for the city. I think it's gonna, I don't even know if I wanna share it with y'all. Just picked up a new boosie. He can fly now. I basically can fly now, no joke about that. You see, I can't tell everybody my secrets because it won't be a secret. So, okay, I, I'll go ahead and tell y'all because I don't even care. Cause it's not like you on. It's, it's not like you, anyone can just turn around and duplicate this. A lot of people can, but it doesn't matter. Basically, what I want to do is wait till Tesla comes out with their competitor. I mean, they're coming out with their um version of Uber and Lyft, right? So when Tesla comes out with their version of Uber, a lot of shareholders are speculating is right now, if you want to go buy a Model 3, you go to the Tesla website, you go to Model 3, you know, you, you, you click on the options, you know, you, you buy the car, you add the, the autopilot, you, you buy the car that way, right? You put, um, you know, you pay $50,000 for the car, okay? So, what I think could happen is, and a lot of um, Tesla shareholders are saying this, is Tesla could come out with a, a, a type of service where you pay $6,000 for the car, and you work and pay off the car. Now, if you take your typical Tesla car, what does a typical Tesla car do? Whenever you, no, no, I didn't say anything about self-driving. No, this is not, the car is not going to drive itself. I didn't say that, okay? That's, that's not what I said. Like, you would be driving the car. A person would be driving the car. Now, 
a normal person, when they're driving a Tesla car, they drive, what, one to two hours a day? Okay, I guess people in LA drive like six hours a day because of the traffic. But, um, okay, one, one to six hours, no, um, one to two hours a day, right? So whenever you're driving, you're feeding back all of that data to Tesla, okay? Now, if you get the car, right, and it's six thousand dollars, you can pay off the car. You're not gonna really have to worry about insurance because Tesla's got their own insurance, so they're gonna take care of you with insurance. So I think that might be one of my 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 exit plans, but I don't exactly know where I would go. <laughs> Like, what city I would go to. Because I do want to eventually leave the city, but I don't know where we go. Memphis? Maybe Nashville? Maybe I've been to Nashville. Nashville is mad expensive, though. Jermaine, after Tesla splits, how many shares will you have? Just curious. So Justin and Robin Hood all have 90. Which is insane. Because what I think is going to happen. I'm, I'm telling y'all. This is what I really think is going to happen. Like. I think when they split that stock price. Okay. So check this out. Yo. Think about this yo. They're splitting the stock price at the end of this month. Next month. At the end of next month is battery day. So they're going to split the stock price this month. So at the end of this month, it'll be like anywhere from $400 a share to $500 a share. Okay. And then they're going to have battery day within like two, three weeks. So <laughs> what do you think is going to happen to the stock price? So Tesla, I think I have a total, I have a total of 33 Tesla shares. But those, but the 33 Tesla shares are under, are at 180, no, at 283. I have more Tesla shares, but I'm not including those in the same number because those were purchased at a much higher cost. Um, and there's less of them because, you know, shit, when it was higher, it was average. I'm just like, oh, let's just buy less, you know? But it will be nice to see. I think it's just going to go right back up. When you cash them out. Um, I'm not going to cash out no time soon. Mm -mm. I'm not selling, like, anything no, no time soon. The only thing I'm selling are very small positions okay so what i did i went through and i bought i was speculating on, on, on some, some stocks and i bought like you know 10 shares of this 20 shares of that 10 shares of this 20 shares of that well a bunch of these were like ev stocks and i'm up like 30 percent but i only bought like 10 shares you know and it's not something like i want to keep buying more of because I can keep buying more of like, you know, this solar energy stock, or I can buy like Tesla, you know what I mean? <laughs> or I can buy, you know, something else, you know? So it's kind of how I look at it. Jermaine, can you call me? What do you mean call me? Do you think CA is dying? I hear a lot of people are leaving. This is why I'm coming up with a California exit plan. But who knows, I may not even take that exit plan. I may just go travel. You know, go backpack around the world for a little bit. California and Don is just millionaires are moving out. Maybe they get her face by all the TikTok is here. Jermaine, how's that new place? Did you find your key? I can't do it. Yep. I haven't found the key yet. Um, I got like a, a spare key, but I like the new place. I have, I've moved in some stuff, but I'm, I'm still at the old place right now. This is my last night here. I remember I texted you, Ma. Yeah, but like, I get a lot of people texting me and messaging me. I'm 
Sorry if I I don't remember. Half from Macedonia. Oh, I miss Macedonia so bad. I miss Eastern Europe, y'all. Yeah. It's so chill. People so friendly. It's really, really warm. <laughs> you gonna cook. <laughs> cook like a turkey. <laughs> Is that this win? I saw. Oh, you got a boy, boy. Boy, boy would be amazing. Mm, what are your plans tomorrow? Work early? Tomorrow? I don't know what I'm going to do tomorrow. I think I may actually go and film a video tomorrow because I didn't really film my video much, uh, much today. Um, so I may go film a video in the morning, like go to a different neighborhood or something, or I may even like try to catch a sunrise or something. I don't know, it's probably going to be cold in the morning, so I don't know if I want to be out trying to catch the sunrise. Mm. Yeah, so I think I'm going to end the stream because I'm, I'm, I'm kind of tired. Yeah. I love all y'all. I will, um, yeah, I'll put out something tomorrow, so stay tuned for a video tomorrow. I love all y'all. Have a good night. My age, I'm old. I'm like old as dirt. I'm like 33. 33. Hideous. Do you have Venmo? I don't have Venmo. I got like deactivated from Venmo. I have um, I have Cash Out. <laughs> Cash Out's awesome. Ready for the Tesla stock split? Yes, I am. Don't forget to say it. Let's get, let's get this video started. All right, peace out. I love all y'all. I'll put up some tomorrow. Out. You guys want to see a Robin Hood video? What about a Robin Hood video? I'm pretty curious. Should I do a Robin Hood video tomorrow? Yes. Yes. Yes, yes. Okay, I'll do a Robin Hood video. I'll just do it because, like, my account's really high, and who knows? That shit might go down on Monday. <laughs> so I'll just do it tomorrow. That way it'll be up. Alright, so peace. Bye-bye.